Good morning, good people. It is Monday morning, February the... I don't know what, what the date is, but it's Monday. This is what's in Candace's lunchbox. She has a uh, chicken bacon ranch roll-up for her main event. Um, that's just the, what is it, Chipotle chicken. The Great Value Chipotle chicken with a little lettuce, some shredded Monterey Jack, and some bacon, and I spread the ranch over the tortilla. For her vegetables, she has the seasoned cucumbers. Um, she has a few pickles in between here. She's got a little pineapple, and then she has some barbecue chips. And for her snacks, she has uh, the white cheddar cheeses with some more pineapple. And her water, of course, is a pink lemonade, Wilder's water flavor. Morning, good people. Today is Tuesday, and this is what's in Cadence's lunchbox. So, here we go. Her main event are these little street tacos, and it's like a little Italian street taco, if that makes sense. So, I use literally street taco shells. I love these for myself and for the kids. The Mission Street Tacos, flour tortillas, very soft, very fluffy, just the right amount of tortilla. I use those shells and I put some Italian slices on there. So I got this from Sam's, natural, no nitrate, all that stuff. Genoa salami, pepperoni, and hard salami. So I put a couple pieces of that on there with just some cheese and I toothpicked it so they could be picked up together and they wouldn't just be flying all around. And then to go with that, she's got these Great Value White Cheddar Flavored Cheez-Its. Um, for her water, she's got her purified water with her um, Hawaiian Punch Green Rush Water Flavor Packet. For her vegetables, she has the cucumbers and seasoning again. I'm trying to finish this cucumber before it goes bad. So she has the cucumber and seasoning again. She has pickles since this is an Italian situation. Um, and then she has a mandarin orange. And for her snack, she likes, she's been having this microwave popcorn at school. So I packed that with the applesauce. Even though if she eats that whole bag, she probably won't eat the applesauce. But she does share her popcorn sometimes. So that is what she has for lunch. I think I'm going to pack a couple of packets of mustard just in case she wants to put mustard on her little Italian street taco. But I don't know. I'm just going to pack it just in case. So that will be it and we'll see y'all Wednesday. Good morning, good people. It is Wednesday and this is what is in Cadence's lunchbox. For her main event, she has a leftover pasta from last night. So this is just a pesto chicken and broccoli uh, spaghetti that I made. So it's spaghetti, thin spaghetti noodles, frozen broccoli, chopped up chicken tenderloins. I sauteed out all the chicken and um, steamed the broccoli with the chicken. Boiled my pasta separately. And I added some of the Aldi uh, pesto. Let me get it. So this is what I used on the pasta. And this is from Aldi. And they have an Alfredo sauce by the same brand. Put those together and you're really cooking with gas. But I'm trying to cut back on cheese here. So I just did the pesto today. And it does give it a different, a really different flavor. Whether you do just pesto sauce or whether you do the pesto and Alfredo. They're really, 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 really delicious. So um, I mixed all that in, make sure I season my pasta and I season my broccoli and I season my chicken. So you definitely want to layer the flavor. It was a hit in this house and I have a house full of very picky people. Cadence and I are the only two that will basically try anything and we like different things. So she wanted pasta uh, last night so that's what she got and again that's leftovers. Uh, I have a side salad for her and this is just chopped up romaine with a little uh, shredded Monterey and some salt and pepper. And she's going to be taking just a house Italian, the wishbone house Italian. And then her fruit, she has some pineapples that I chopped up and prepped um, this past weekend. So we've been eating on those and packing those for lunch. And they're already ready to go with a mandarin orange. And then for her water, it is the green rush, the Hawaiian punch green rush. And then for her snack, she has a peanut butter chocolate chip chewy bar and a gala apple. And that is it.
course she has her fork to eat all of this she will be able to take this out if she wants now the great thing about the pastas that I usually make or I guess any pasta you can make is she really accepts spaghetti I would not eat any type of red cold red sauce personally but these types of pastas she does not have to warm up sometimes she likes it better cold but if she wanted she can just take this part of her good bin dipper set out put it in the microwave warm it up so she doesn't have to worry about trying to um, stick the whole thing in there or trying to move this food out just to warm it up so that's why I put it in this dipper set just want to let you guys know that it makes it a lot easier for her to warm if she wants it warm like I said if she does not want it warm then she can just eat it and go either way hot lunch cold lunch it could be both and it tastes really good I mean it just tastes like pasta salad if it's cold so if you like pasta salad cold pasta cold meat if you're okay with that then boom there you go so this is her lunch for Wednesday we'll see y'all tomorrow peace hello good people it is Thursday and this is what is in Cadiz's lunch box so we're back to a sandwich we've been doing a lot of sandwiches lately just different variations this one is cream cheese mustard and it is that um what was it called it was like an Italian meat selection from the Italian street taco lunch I think that was like maybe two lunches ago so same meat um she doesn't like very much meat on her sandwich so she literally has the Genoa salami the pepperoni and the hard salami and that's it between um some honey wheat split top great value bread and like i said i got some cream trees blah got some great value cream cheese spread on there um, for her vegetables, she has these nature sweet cherub tomatoes. I really love the Constellation tomatoes, but they did not have any at the Walmart I went to most conveniently tonight. So, we got these regular, regular cherub tomatoes, which are still more sweet than a Roma or a steak tomato or any on the vine tomato. But the cherub, the, um, I'm sorry. The Constellation Tomatoes take the cake every time. And they're pretty. But I just got some of these cherry tomatoes with some garlic salt and some pepper for her. Um, and then she has a mandarin orange. Oops. Fly away veggie straw. A mandarin orange already peeled. And then she's got some zesty ranch veggie straws. And they're just great value too. I'm trying to finish those up. Um, and for her drink, I'm sorry, her water, she has a regular water with the, not regular water, she has a Members Mark bottle water with the, um, Wilder's Pink Lemonade water flavor packet. And for her snack, she has the Great Value Mixed Berry Fruit and Grain Bar, which is like a nutri grain bar, and an apple. And that's going to be her lunch for Thursday. We'll see y'all tomorrow, which is Friday, which is the last day of lunch for this week. Good morning, good people. It is Friday. Yes, 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 Lord. It is Friday. Um, and this is what's in Cadence's lunchbox. So she has some broiled beef hot dogs here with some seasoned cherry tomatoes with a mandarin orange. That's the last mandarin orange. That is the last of the white cheddar Cheez-Its and then for her snack she has sliced apples with lemon juice already on them to keep them from getting so brown and then she has an apple cinnamon fruit and grain bar and this is actually the Aldi brand and then for her drink she has a water with the Wilder's pink lemonade flavor packet and that is going to be all for this fanciful Friday. We will see you guys next week. You have a wonderful, wonderful, safe, productive weekend. And don't forget to check out January's Grocery Haul if you want a few grocery ideas. Um, and if you want a few lunch ideas, don't forget to check out the entire playlist of What's in Cadence's Lunchbox. Or the entire Grocery Haul playlist for that matter. Um, if you're going shopping this weekend, there will not be a grocery haul for February because I didn't do one big shopping trip for February. I've just been plugging in where it's needed and I just didn't have the time to film choppy little hauls. So, I will see y'all for the grocery haul in March and we'll see you next week for the next lunch video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share and share alike.